You've all seen those videos where photographers show you the contents of their camera bag before they go on a shoot to let you know what kind of gear they use or before they're set off to go off traveling. Well, how about a mobile camera bag? Let's look at things a little different today. I've got a bag that is all packed for our trip to Paris. I'll be shooting Photo Walks TV episodes there. And uh, it's a mobile bag. It's very different. I actually have, believe it or not, six cameras packed in the bag to which you're wondering why. I have a good reason. Let's go over the contents of everything in the bag, starting with the travel tripod from Me Photo. Fits in a bag, folds right up. I never leave home without a tripod to shoot time lapses, the world flying by. I'll get the cables out of the way. I've got a uh, his and her iPhone charger, two plugs, and then other plugs for USB stuff. So we'll get that out of the way, move it over here. And speaking of uh, chargers, French AC adapters. So got to have those, right? And these ones are really cool. I bought them on Amazon. I've got two little slots there for USB as well. So we got that. Uh, cameras. Two iPhones. Uh, one is my main video camera. The other one is used for time-lapse photography, the world going by. Two GoPros. Here's one. And then, whoops, here's the other. Two GoPros. Why two GoPros? Well, when one runs out of battery, the other one can go straight into action. And they're so small that they fit in the camera bag. I also use this JAWS adapter, which is really cool. It snaps two tables and uh, it snaps to the windshield of cars when you're getting your driving shot. And who knows, maybe I'll snap it right onto the Eiffel Tower. Stay tuned for that. Cameras. I've got two Insta360, I've got the X2, and I've got the X3. This is the wild camera with two lenses, the front and the back, the left and the right. And I will never make a travel video without one. Uh, it is really cool because it gets the front and the back. I can get a shot of what I'm seeing as well as what is being seen behind me. Uh, looks, it's great for uh, walking shots. It's great for riding ferries, and um, I'm really happy to have it. Uh, very, very important, a power brick, power brick accessory. This will give you another eight hours of charge. You know that if you're running around town photographing all day, you're going to run out of juice. So this will really come in handy. All you have to do is make sure to charge it up ahead of time, and then you plug a USB cable right into here, right into your phone. Uh, tripod smartphone mounts. These fit on top of a tripod and you slip your phone right in there. Can't do anything without them. Here's another one. Here's another iPhone battery. This crazy little magnet is for the GoPro. I stick this under my shirt and then I can connect the, the, iPhone, the uh, GoPro and walk down the street with it. Good for walking shots. Um, microphones. I make videos. I need microphones. You notice I'm wearing one right here. This fits into the phone. It's really easy when I do interviews. I can't wait to hear French accents. Stick them on somebody. And uh, they're non-threatening. They're really cool. I'm, I left the best for last. My selfie stick. The Insta360 selfie stick that doubles as a little mini tripod. This thing is invaluable. People say to me all the time, do I need a gimbal? Do I need a cage to steady the shot when I'm, I'm doing video? I know you don't because you could put the iPhone on here or a smartphone or a GoPro or a Galaxy or whatever. Um, and here, let's, let's do it. Here it is. Here's the gimbal. I can walk up and down the street with this. I can get really steady video. If I have to do two hands, I could do it. Or Open this baby up if I want to address the camera and talk into it. I could put this at any cafe and look straight into the lens 
and have a chat. So that is my camera bag. I'm all mobile. I'm not bringing any big cameras with me to France because the advancement in smartphones over the last few years has been just amazing in, in the camera technology. I can shoot 4K video. I can shoot time lapses. I can do slow-mo. I can get great stills. I can get um, wide angle shots. I can get street photography shots. And uh, I do every episode of Photo Walks TV on mobile cameras, so why not go to France with mobile cameras? Next up, Paris. So look for the episodes from Paris coming soon on Photo Walks TV. In the interim, please subscribe to the Photo Walks TV channel. Please subscribe as well to the Photo Walks TV newsletter, jeffersongram.substack.com. Look for me on Twitter, at Jefferson Graham, and I look forward to seeing you from Paris. Au revoir.